Hi, this is Firestarter and a blast from the past. This is a review of the SH Fregards Kamen Rider Kuga growing form. So this is actually his blank form before he uh, uh, turned into the uh, mighty form. So this is the box, quite plain, um, because this is an old SH Fregard. We have the figure right here, or the character, and then we have the Bandai Collector Shop logo, Kuga, the name, Bandai, and then uh, Mask Rider Kuga right here on top on the other side and then at the back just a few details about uh, Kamen Rider Kuga so let us open this box so we can check more what this is inclusive with bringing back to basics is this SH Fregard's Kamen Rider Kuga growing form with power yet to be realized the weakest form also has lesser details than standard forms with this, the main color is white and the only visible grongi symbols are on the collar and just below the chest. Most obvious features are the short horns on his head. Since this form doesn't carry any weapons, Bandai has given us with 7 extra hand replacements with white knuckle guards. Back in the day, default fists are easy to detach to fit in the replacements such as his thumbs up extra hand and others like popular super open splayed hands. Now let's go through the articulation points for this figure. We have a head and neck joint that moves freely and then we have uh, shoulder pads that go up and down. Sometimes they snap off but it's not really a huge issue because as long as you retain these stubs right here, no, no worries. So we have upper bicep uh, cut right here, double jointed elbow, a wrist joint, upper torso and waist. Uh, the waist just only goes side to side it doesn't go 360 leg movement from the old sh free guards and then upper thigh cut uh, double jointed knees and an ankle joint that goes forward and back side to side and a die cast pair of feet so that's all you need to know about uh, Kamen Rider Kuga growing form and if you have a chance still chan have a chance to get one of these I do recommend it especially for Kamen Rider Kuga fans. The SH Fregard's Kamen Rider Kuga growing form back then was an easy skip since in the show this version of Kuga was the weakest and collectors were more keen in standard and final forms. But I want newbies to consider picking this one up to recollect how Bandai used to make simple but effective SH Fregards coupled with solid die cast feet. A feature that has been faded throughout the years. And that is my review of the SH Fregards Kamen Rider Kuga growing form. If you want to know the possibilities and details of the figure, check out the photos at the end of the video and subscribe to my blog for the full written review. This is Far Starter. Thank you very much for watching and keep it here for more toy reviews.